Long anticipated municipal elections across the state will round out 2023 on Tuesday in the city of Great Falls. It's been a year of levies and a ballot full of decisions for voters. The ballot holds the weight of multiple elected positions for city of Great Falls mayor. Four candidates, including Abby Brown, Joe McKinney, Corey Reeves and Casey Schreiner for city commission, Kendall Cox, Eric Heimbaugh, Michaela Stroop, Rick Tryon and Shannon Wilson. Two seats will be chosen for Department A Municipal Judge Stephen Bolstead and Department B Mark Dunn and Kale Halberg. And finally, the neighborhood councils will be chosen. Be sure to read the fine print on how many to vote for. And the most contested measure is the public safety levy and bond. The levy asks for 103.75 permanent mills, a near $13.5 million price tag if passed. And the bond measure is an additional tax percentage that could add an additional $20 to yearly property taxes per $100,000 assessed market value to your home. Those votes are yes or no. The Cascade County Elections Office had one issue with the new envelope printing service out of Helena. That issue has since been resolved. I, I think it, uh, there's always going to be some duplicates anyway. Some of them come from the system, some of them come from the printing. But we catch those, the machine, as much as we can. If people bring them in, we'll fix it. The system will not allow duplicates. It will catch that the, someone's tried to vote, they have two ballots, and then we will get the alert and we will fix that. We'll avoid one and keep the other. It's important to note that Belton Cascade requested polling place elections and the Great Falls Municipal election is strictly by mail. The Montana Expo Park will be open to only tabulate ballots on Tuesday. If you do wish to register or drop your ballot in person, the Cascade County Elections Office will be open from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. on November 7th and no polling will take place at the Expo Park. For more information and look ahead into Tuesday's election, visit this story on our website. In the studio, Ryan Gamboa, MTN News.